KNC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K. Up and hey, sports fans. Coming up on the sportscast, a brand new fast episode and highlights in week 18 in the GFA men's division one soccer. But let's turn straight to the NCAA men's college basketball championship game as the North Carolina Tar Heels won their seventh college title, edging out the Bulldogs from Gonzaga today, 71-65. Tar Heel guard Joel Berry II led North Carolina with 22 points and center Kennedy Meeks was the leading rebounder 10 boards today. Congratulations again to the North Carolina Tar Heels. Let's turn now to the GFA training facilities in Harmon for week 18 in Division I men's soccer. Saturday night action with Guam Shipyard taking on quality distributors. First goal of the game would be Shipyard's Donovan Rages with the assist from number 10 Mark Chargula. Shipyard goes up 1-0 and that's pretty much how the first half would end. But in the second half, quality's number six Josh Pangalinen would tie it up with this pretty kick from about 40 yards right over the head of Shipyard Tony Wabauta, the goalie. Nice kick, Josh. What about a replay? Why not say half a day to my little friend? <laughs> Donovan Rages would get his second goal of the game with this left foot punch. Quality goes up two to one. Look at Quality's number 13. How he did it again, I don't know. Shipyard would add one more goal with great passing and a finish by number six, Don Weeksy. Take a look at great teamwork right here. Passing, one, two, three, boom. That would be 3-1. Guam Shipyard stays on top, 3-1 with the win. They stay on top. In the second game of the night, it would be Team Hadza over Bank of Guam Strikers, six to five. And now it's time for a brand new fast episode. Today we feature the catcher from the JFK Islanders girls softball team. Her name is Olivia Iriarte. Hi, today my name is Olivia Iriarte and I am a catcher for the John F. Kennedy Islanders. Describe yourself in three words. Motivated, ambitious, and hardworking. Who's your favorite sports personality? Sierra Romero, of the, uh, she plays for University of Michigan. Yeah, she's their um, midfield, shortstop, or second base, yeah. What do you like about the sport that you're playing? I like that it's a mental game. It challenges your mind. Um, you can be athletic. But if you cannot perform because your mind is getting the best of you, then that's what you need to work on. Name the top person that gave you advice in the sport that you're playing now. My mom, actually. Um, whether I do good or bad, you know, she's supporting me. Who's your favorite sports team? Uh, the Oklahoma Sooners. They uh, won the NCAA championship last year, the World Series for softball, yeah. What is your most memorable game or sports experience? The most memorable experience was I got the opportunity to go to All-Stars when I was nine years old. Um, I was the only girl in the tournament, um, and I got the opportunity to pitch against some of the, like, um, greater softball teams, or softball, baseball teams. Yeah, so, and I pitched, and I didn't give as much runs as the guy before me, so that was great. <laughs> Salmon Linguini, uh, Burgundy, Kehlani, uh, Shot Down by Khalid, Apple, uh, Ellen DeGeneres, my mom, I love my mom, yeah, she's over there, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> she's like, <laughs> no pressure, but you know, I do love my mom, yeah. This is brought to you by 76 and Circle K. And that's Olivia Iriarte, JFK Islanders softball catcher from the 2017 champions. And that's going to wrap it up for this Tuesday. Join me again on Thursday for another fast episode for PNC Sports First. I'm Leo Payumo. I'll see you tomorrow.
NC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K.